Hey, players. So a Georgia sheriff has resigned after pleading guilty to groping Judge Hatchet. Y'all go ahead and grab your tea and have a seat. Let's talk about it. So according to reports, Blinkley County Sheriff Chris Cootie has resigned after he pled guilty to groping Judge Hatchet in 2022. I declare, honey, what a disgrace. So the arrest warrant alleged that Chris Cootie grabbed Judge Hatchet's chest at a Renaissance Atlanta Raverly Bar while attending a Georgia Sheriff's Association winter meeting in January of 2022. Now, the former sheriff of DeKalb County, Thomas Brown, said that he witnessed the incident and he had to physically intervene. He said that Judge Hatchett was his guest at the conference and that Chris Cootie grabbed Judge Hatchett as he was introducing her to the sheriffs. He said that the incident occurred when he and Judge Hatchett were at a stand-up table and the three sheriffs came over to introduce themselves. He said he turned his head just for a brief moment while uh, Judge Hatchett and Chris Cootie were talking, but as he turned his head back to focus on the two of them, he saw Chris Cootie's hand go down on her left breast. He said he grabbed his arm and threw it off her chest and basically said, what the F do you think you're doing? And that's basically where it ended. So today in court, Chris Cootie agreed to 12 months of probation, 40 hours of community service, a $500 fine, and he also agreed to complete an alcohol and drug course. He also sent his resignation letter to Governor Brian Kemp and the Georgia Sheriff Association. During the hearing, Judge Hatchett said, for this man to come up and violate me the way he did is unspeakable. It is important for the defendant and everyone present to understand the horrific effect this has had on me. She continued by saying she prides herself on being a strong woman, but admitted, that the whole situation has cut her to her core. I declare, honey, what a disgrace. Some people just think they could do anything to anybody and get away with it. And unfortunately, this guy was in a position where he could do things like this and get away with it. Um, this is probably just the one and only time that he has gotten caught. I'm thankful that Judge Hatchett has gotten um, the justice that she deserves. And hopefully this guy learns a lesson from his deviant behavior. All right, players, put your thoughts in the comments. Let me know what you're thinking. This is Double D Mother for the Black Accurate News. See, my eyes are still puppy. I cried and cried and cried in court. And thankfully, I've at least gotten that out so that I hopefully won't break down today, and I might. But what I said is that there is a scar that he left. And what I really resent is that someone could have that kind of power over me. That somebody could make me in that moment feel helpless. I have never felt so helpless in my entire life. And I was angry, frankly. I was angry that I didn't slap him. I didn't kick him. But now I understand victims. I was absolutely frozen.